Hi everyone, it's Yolani again. As you can see, I'm doing free videos in the same outfit. I don't have a lot of time. My daughter's sleeping next door. <laughs> anyway, um, so this is my time. I'm doing this for you. Okay, so how does a plate of food look? Okay, that's important. So my first video, the one, two videos ago, we looked, talked about emotional eating, how to break the pattern, understanding why you're eating. So one of the reasons why you will be eating is actually to feed yourself. So what does your body need? Um, and, and, and if you're hungry, you're standing in front of the fridge, you're standing, you're going to put some food on a plate, and you're doing that because you are hungry. Your body is telling me, please give me certain things, nutrition. So you need vitamins, minerals, you need fats, please, you need it. Okay, fat is a good thing. Oils, you need um, meat. Okay, if you're not a vegetarian, whatever, you need protein. Let's just call it protein. Um, you need some starch. If you have no starch, um, you will feel uh, not a lot of energy. Believe me, I tried that. <laughs> Maybe you can do it. I, don't, I can't. Um, okay, so, so that's But how does the plate of food look. Most people learn that the plate of food is a lot of starch with a little bit, you know, from meats and fats and then a little bit of maybe and you know, a little bit of, of vegetable, but actually, um, if, you know, sort of, let's say this is now my plate of food, um, most of what's on that plate should be vegetables and fruits, okay. Some people don't mix that, okay, eat your fruit later, that's fine, but most of that needs to be just vegetables, green stuff, and you know, make it nice, okay, make it interesting, you know, put some spices on it. Uh, put uh, Himalayan salt. You can eat a lot of Himalayan salt, not table salt. Okay. So, but what on your plate is going to be a lot of vegetables, and then the second thing, the second largest portion, or let's say weight on the plate, is going to be your protein. Very important. Okay. Um, so those two things is is very important for your body, and it's it's not necessarily just going to cause, um, you know, a lot of of damage to your body. And it's also going to make you full with your protein. Make sure that there is some nice sauce, some nice fat. Depends on what like protein, cheeses, all that stuff. But it's cool. It's about the the balance. Need a lot of fruits, vegetables, then protein, then starch. Starch the smallest. Okay. Um, that's sort of a healthy plate of food. Sometimes you want to have a starch meal, okay, break it, break, have one meal a week starch, but if you're going to have just starch, 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 that's all actually just sugar, 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 and it just, your body, there's not a lot of vitamins, sorry, there's not vitamins and minerals in starch, but there's vitamins and minerals in vegetables, you can, your body cannot take vitamins and minerals in without oil and fat so don't be stupid put oil on it there's some good oils canola oil is actually a cheaper oil and it's a good oil you can also just do the you know the oh my gosh i'm forgetting olive oil <laughs> just the olive oil is also good i'm totally for butter so um, you can try butter, I'm, going, I'm totally for butter and for, for bone stock and stuff to, to make some sauces for the meat and all that stuff. Okay, so just so meat also has a lot of things that your body needs. So just calm down a little bit on the starch and start going up on the vegetables, okay. And potato, okay, potato can actually just be a starch. So okay, you can just have a plate of potato, so just vegetables, meats, a little bit of starch. Okay, see how that works for you. Um, try it. Okay, and um, tell me um, any feedback that you want. Thank you so much.